Eevee, one of, if not the most notable Pokemon in the game for specific reasons. It took this long, oh my god, please. How can you get every single evolution in Kabumon to get that sweet, sweet achievement? It's honestly not that hard. But before we get too deep, make sure to hit that subscribe button for more tips and tricks. First, there are five total evolution stones that you have to collect in order to get the five typical evolutions. These include Leafeon, Glaceon, Jolteon, not you, and finally Flareon. I have this Eevee on my shoulder here. Let's pick up one of these stones. I like Glaceon, and we're just gonna go ahead and right click it. At the bottom left, it'll say it's ready to evolve. Hit M, and then click evolve, and evolve again. And beautiful, just like that, any one of these stones works in the exact same way. But wait, where are all of these evolution stones even at, you ask? Well, luckily, we have a very, very educated professor here joining us to tell us exactly where we can find all of them. I'm passing it off to you, Professor M. Thank you, Marth, and I'm going to share everything you need to know about these special stones. Now, you may be wondering, how can I get these cool stones? Well, fear not, evolution stones can be found in two types of places, common and rare spots. Let me break it down for you. A common stone likes to hang out in two main groups. The first group likes to show up eight times in each chunk, forming clusters of one to two stones. You can find them between levels 64 and 320, with the most appearing around 192. The second group is similar, but appears between the levels negative 64 and 92, with a lot around level 64. Now let's talk about where you can find all these fantastic stones. I've made a handy list of biomes where each stone hangs out. You can also find an easy to follow wiki link in the video description. For instance, if you're after a moonstone, good luck, it's a bit tricky because it only appears in two biomes. But don't worry, just remember the levels I mentioned earlier and you'll be on the right track. In simple terms, if you're on the lookout for stones, check out levels 192 and 64 for the best chances. So with the information I gave you, go out there and explore. Your EV adventures are about to get even more exciting, and enjoy the hunt. Thank you so much, Morph. Now, a lot of you might be wondering about what I would consider probably the coolest evolutions. You definitely know if you tuned into the Trainer Haven SMP. That would be Umbreon, Sylveon, and Espeon. And through a decent bit of testing, me and Morph have discovered that the friendship has to be at exactly 62%, and the level has to be at 25. Each of these EVs evolve with very specific conditions in mind. Espeon, you have to have a friendship of 62, like we mentioned, and it has to evolve in the daytime. Sylveon has to have a friendship of 62 and have a fairy type move learned. And Umbreon, like Sylveon, has to evolve at night with 62% friendship. And make sure that these EVs are level 25 or you're gonna end up with just a, a lot of wasted time trying to get that friendship up. I hope you guys learned what you needed to learn from this video. There's definitely gonna be a lot more Cobblemon tips and tricks as time progresses. So definitely stay tuned for that. If you wanna be on top of your game and whatever server you're playing with, or just to show your friends that you're super knowledgeable and cool. And thanks again to Morph for all of the help. He was such a big influence in this video and absolutely very knowledgeable on each of the stones and where to find them. So once again, check out Morph's channel and thank you so much. All right, I'll see you guys in the next one. So if you enjoyed, make sure to hit that like and subscribe button and have a good day.